Welcome to our tech tutorial. Today we're tackling a question that many MySQL users encounter. How to add a column using the alter command while also inputting specific values into it. Our viewer wants to add a new column called temp ID and set its value to three for every row in the table. Let's break this down and find the best way to achieve this. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're going to be going through a question, going through those answers, and hopefully it leads to your solution. Remember, stay a little bit crazy, just like me, to get through to your resolution. Now let's get started. To add a new column to an existing table in MySQL, we use the alter table statement. In this case, we want to add a column named temp ID. The syntax for adding a column is straightforward. We specify the table name, the add column keyword, and then define the new column's name and data type. Now to set a default value for the new column, we can use the default keyword. In this case, we want every row to have a value of three for temp ID. Putting it all together, here's the complete command to add the temp ID column with a default value of three. After executing this command, every existing row in your table will have the temp ID column set to three. You can verify this by selecting the data from your table. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To add a new column in MySQL, you can use the alter table command. You can specify where to place the new column using the after keyword. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To add a column in MySQL, you can use the alter table command. Simply specify the table name, the new column name, and its data type. For more detailed information, you can refer to the W3Schools website. And that's it. I hope you found the solution that you're looking for. If you did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time that you need technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.